When it comes to how teens around the world are using digital media, it's clear that we aren't seeing the whole picture. Much of what is known about adolescent digital media use and its consequences center on high-income economies, particularly in the US and Western Europe. Lower and middle-income economies should not be ignored. In fact, in just the past two decades, internet growth rates have exploded in Africa, Asia, Latin America, and the Middle East. In some of these regions, it's grown as much as 12,500 percent. All that growth has transformed life in the emerging and developing world. Teens in every corner of the world are maturing during a time of mass upheaval in the way societies communicate, learn, socialize, and do business. The ways in which adolescents experience these radical transformations firsthand deserves more detailed study. We know that each culture interacts with and is influenced by digital media in its own unique way. But what does that relationship mean for teens within these cultures? Understanding and learning from these unique perspectives means science can begin challenging the conventional wisdom about what it means to be a teen in the digital age. What is obvious is that there is no typical experience. Instead, there are a wide range of experiences that depend on who that person is and what culture they live in. It will take thoughtful research from scientists around the world to bring the whole picture into focus. Ironic as it may sound, it appears the key to understanding a teen's inner life is a matter of zooming way, way out. From that lofty perspective, we may just begin to see teens in a whole new way. This video is based on a chapter in the Handbook of Adolescent Digital Media Use and Mental Health. You can learn more about how to protect teens from the risks of digital media by downloading a free copy of the handbook at www.teensandtech.org handbook.